Morning guys, today we're going to be talking about ratios. Now don't switch off, unsubscribe or any of that business. It might interest you, especially if you're a road biker that wants to use mountain bike components. Let me talk you through it. Here we go. Okay, so this is a road bike. It's an e-road bike, but it's a road bike. So really, it's a motorbike. But anyway, these are 10 speed shifters. This is a mountain bike derailleur. And this here is a nine speed cassette. Now the reason there's a nine speed cassette on this is because if there was a 10 speed cassette on this, the ratios would be out because the ratio pull between a 10 speed mountain bike derailleur and a 10 speed shifter for a road bike is completely different so it won't, wouldn't get the full range of the, of the cassette so in order to fix that we need to do some witchcraft and here we have made in a cauldron by a few old hags and uh, witches in the black forest in germany we have that witchcraft now this is just generally a simple pulley system which changes the ratio and it's from a company called JTEC and they're all numbered they know exactly what ratio changes from what to where so I'm going to have a go at installing this I'll let you know if it works obviously Welcome guys, it's not all about the glamorous life of riding mountain bikes all the time I do actually have a job to do and this is my job, a mountain bike mechanic obviously so we're changing some of the components now, so we're taking the old chain off, that's no good. We're also taking the old derailleur off, it's an old mountain bike 9 speed derailleur. We don't need that, we've got a brand new Dior, Shimano Dior with a shadow clutch. So that's going to be fitted on shortly. We also have to change the shift cable. Obviously we've got to wrap it around a pulley system, so the cable that's already installed is way too short. And there's the new derailleur, the new Dior derailleur, that's going on. I'll talk it up a little bit later. Just takes a little bit of figuring out. The instructions aren't the most clear and the, the drawings on the, the instructions aren't exactly the best. But from what I gather, what well, mountain bike derailleurs don't come with any adjuster and road bike shifters don't either. Unlike mountain bike shifters. That's another reason why you buy mountain bike instead of road bike. I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. First of all, what you need to buy is a little barrel adjuster. Now Jaguar do these, they're about eight pound each. And that'll fit into there, like that. So there's your adjustment for your cable. Now the JTEC ratio changer actually comes with a little bushing, which then fits into there like that. Now you can do it one of two ways. You can either cut the cable in the, in the middle here and have the cable a little bit longer out of here or you can just put it straight in the derailleur like that. I need to find out what my customer wants. Next step, so cable goes in, up and around on the big groove. There's a little flat section here, I don't know if you can see it. The cable crosses over there, up the thin groove and out the other side. So in a sense, that's what it looks like. You could do with putting a bit of gland on here, because that's not very strong, so I'm going to have a look if I can replace that. But that, in a sense, is what it looks like. So I'm just cycling through the gears here. Basically, when we tried it originally without the ratio changer, it only got the first eight gears and not the ten gear because the ratio is completely different. So it seems to get all the gears, but it all depends on how far it pushes it along now on the ratio. So I'm going to get the cassette on, the new cassette on the wheel, and we'll go from there. Q component change montage. Right, cassettes off. Greasing the free hook body in preparation for the new cassette. And now we've got a Sunrace. I think it's an 1142 cassette. Making sure it's all 
up correctly and talk to the correct setting which is 40 newton meters. Bit fiddly sometimes to get these wheels on. Axle in. Gloves on. Messing with chains, very important. Stick your gloves on. We don't want the dermatitis. This chain was flipping massive. 136 links. What takes 136 links? Maybe the new mountain bikes, um, like the Forbidden Druid, which has got the high idler. I don't know. to cycle through these gears now just to make sure we can actually get all the gears it works fantastic just don't forget when you buy one of these JTEC ratio adjusters you're gonna need to have a barrel adjuster because they don't come stock uh, the mountain bike derailleurs now the funny thing is if it was a nine speed and under it'd work with a mountain bike uh, derailleur but the 10 speed and the 11 speed have now they, they changed the ratios so you will need to buy one of these um, because your road bike shifters are not going to work with a 10 or 11 speed mountain bike derailleur the ratio is going to be different I will put the ratio differences in 10 speed and 11 speed on the screen if you're interested in getting this done let me know and uh, we can go from there but if you enjoyed this video if you found this video informative Give me a thumbs up, give me a like and give me a subscribe, it really helps the channel out and we'll catch you later.